गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन नाउ कंप्यूटर एंड टॉपिक दैट इज इनपुट डिवाइस इन कंप्यूटर सिस्टम सो इफ यू चेक दिस पिक्चर द नंबर ऑफ इनपुट डिवाइस आर दियर एंड द मोस्ट कॉमनली यूज डिवाइस और द मोस्ट कॉमनली यूज इनपुट डिवाइस आर द की बोर्ड एंड द माउस विदाउट वेज यू कैन नॉट वर्क ऑन टू दी कंप्यूटर सो एज यू कैन रिकोगनाइज दैट दिस इज वन की बोर्ड एंड दिस इज वन माउस देन वट आर रेस्ट ऑफ द इनपुट डिवाइस this uh, type of input device is basically the webcam and uh, this is joystick and whenever you are playing game whenever you play the game then you use this uh, joystick uh, as an input device then after that this is uh, one scanner then uh, digital camera is there with the help of which you just uh, give the input in the form of a picture then after that touch screen is also come under the input device why because whenever you touch uh, to the computer screen then obviously what you are doing you are basically giving the input to the computer like if you are selecting basically with the help of this pointing or with the help of this touch screen what you are doing you are selecting something you are clicking on the clicking on the screen so this is this comes under the input device so hope this thing is clear then now come to the topic that is input devices uh, if you check your syllabus then obviously this part has been completed that is introduction to computer and information technology this uh, complete part has been covered then after that we are uh, in this part that is components of computer or the hardware so uh, what we are doing uh, right now we are doing the input devices we are uh, studying the input devices and uh, if we talk about this functional block diagram then we have covered this uh, topic in the previous lectures so uh, the first of all we will complete uh, this part that is components of computer then only we will move to the next uh, like uh, next paragraph that is categories of computer so come to the topic that is input devices so basically uh, if we talk about like our daily life then in our daily life uh, we generally use computer system and uh, uh, if uh, in total if we talk about then almost 85 to 90 percent people use computer in our life and uh, in our day to day work so uh, we can say that uh, if you want to use computer system then obviously uh, you have to give input to the computer then only you can use it so what is the role of input devices or you can say what are basically these input devices so now come to the answer that is input devices are some of the electronic devices that are used by the user to input the data into the computer system this is basically the main uh, role of the of the input devices within the computer system so uh, like if we talk about the data which we give with the help of the input device so what do you mean by the data i think i have discussed in the previous lecture also like uh, what do you mean by the data so the term data means uh, like any kind of number or text or sound or image so these all comes under the category that is data so with the help of input device what we are doing we are giving data to the computer system and if you talk about the most commonly used input devices then obviously keyboard or mouse is one of the most commonly used input devices without which we cannot imagine the computer system we cannot work within the computer system so these are one of the most commonly used devices or you can say these are the essential parts of the computer system now uh, come to the topic uh, and you can say like uh, come to the point that is uh, what do you mean by the keyboard so keyboard is the most common and a very popular input device which helps to input the data to the computer system it means if we talk about the layout of the keyboard then it looks like a traditional typewriter like if you have seen the computer the uh, keyboard it obviously it looks like a traditional typewriter so although there are some additional keys also uh, which provide some uh, additional functions so if we talk about the keyboard then there are basically different number of uh, keyboards with the different number of keys also like 84 keys keyboards uh, were also there 
देन वन जीरो वन एंड वन जीरो टू कीज़ की बोर्ड इज ऑल्सो देर देन वन जीरो फोर कीज एंड वन जीरो एट कीज की बोर्ड आर इन द मार्केट सो वी आर हैविंग डिफरेंट नंबर ऑफ की बोर्ड्स विद डिफरेंट नंबर ऑफ कीज ऑल्सो लाइक यू कैन चेक इट विद द हेल्प ऑफ दिस इमेज ऑफ की बोर्ड दैट वी आर हैविंग डिफरेंट नंबर ऑफ फंक्शनल कीज विद इन दिस की बोर्ड लाइक फ्रॉम एफ वन अप टू एफ ट्वेल्व सो दीज आर बेसिकली वॉन्ट दीज आर द फंक्शनल कीज देर आफ्टर दैट न्यूमेरिक की पैड इज ऑल्सो देअर मीन्स इन वेज द नंबर कीज आर रिटर्न देर आफ्टर दैट दीज आर द एल्फाबैथ कीज सो दीज आर वॉट दीज ऑल आर द नंबर ऑफ कीज विच आर गिवन इन द की बोर्ड सो वन बाई वन वी विल डिस्कस इन like uh, if you ch- uh, check the uh, this picture on the keyboard then like uh, you can uh, st- uh, you can check that these are the functional keys as i have sh- uh, as i have told you then uh, backspace key is also there in which backspace is, r- is written then these are the navigation keys like uh, navigation keys are also there then after that directional keys means uh, with the help of which you just give the direction to the computer system so these uh, like uh, left arrow right arrow uh, up and down so these are what these are the directional keys then numeric keypad is also there uh, in which uh, like uh, around 0 to 9 uh, numbers are there then after that arithmetic operation buttons are also there so this is basically the numeric keypad then uh, this is what this is one alt key this is windows key which is available on both of the side like these three keys are available on both of the side so these keys comes are within the keyboard two times so uh, this is uh, these are the directional keys so this is basically the structure of the keyboard and uh, if you want to uh, if you want to purchase one uh, wireless keyboard then you can purchase it from the market wireless keyboard is also available into the market uh, means if you want to uh, like uh, without uh, without uh, wire if you want to buy uh, like keyboard without the wire then you can purchase wireless keyboard also then after that uh, the number of keys which are available on to the keyboard are as follows like first one the first type of keys which are available into the keyboard is the typing keys so typing keys what do we mean by typing keys like these keys includes the letter keys from capital a to z and digit keys means the number keys are also count under the typing key from which uh, which is basically from 0 to 9 so these are the uh, typing keys then after that numeric keypad is also there in which we are having the set of 16 to 17 keys means uh, the number keys from uh, like the number keys are there from 0 to 9 and then after that some arithmetic uh, operation keys are also there so we'll combine it then after that it will be around set of uh, 16 to 17 keys so these type of keys comes under the numeric keypad so it is used to enter the numeric data or to cursor the movement so generally generally if we talk about the number keys or the numeric keypad then the set of 16 to 17 keys are there then after that if we talk about if we talk about the functional keys then the 12 functional keys are there which are present on the keyboard and if you check your keyboard then these uh, functional keys are arranged in a row like you just check your keyboard while uh, studying this uh, uh, video lecture also now uh, you just check like number of function keys are arranged in a in one row from f1 up to f12 and each and every key is having some function which is uh, i think uh, mentioned which is uh, like shown with the help of graphics also you just check your keyboard then after that uh, the next type of key is uh, the control keys in terms of control keys basically we are having uh, the most of the control keys which are controlling the screen part or which are controlling the cursor part like uh, control keys there home keys there so for example if you have opened one uh, file then if you click on home then it will it will move to the uh, to the basic page or to the home page 
then after that and keys there insert keys there delete page up page down and uh, control key alternate key escape key so these all are the control keys then uh, the next type of keys which are available onto the keyboard so these are special purpose keys uh, and uh, these special purpose keys uh, we are having some keys like uh, number lock is there caps lock is there and uh, shift space uh, space bar tab and print screen so these all are the special purpose keys hope you have understood that uh, how many types of keys are there in a keyboard then after that the next input device that is mouse so mouse is what mouse is also one kind of uh, most important uh, input device with the help of which you cannot work within the computer system because with the help of um, uh, mouse basically you are pointing or uh, basically you are controlling the computer so therefore it is also called a pointing device and uh, the mouse is used to open or close uh, and even drag and drop files icons software etc so the use of mouse has increased a lot with the introduction of graphical user interface if you check the images of mouse then this is one uh, optical mouse then after that this is one wireless mouse so we are having both of the mouse uh, in uh, today's uh, in today's uh, market so uh, hope you have understood uh, these two types of input devices that is keyboard and mouse then in the next lecture we will discuss some more input devices so till then you just note down these input devices within your notebook and uh, if there is any like uh, problem then we will discuss it in the interactive session so till then thank you everyone thank you so much